My favorite uh, was always Rocket Queen. Like everybody goes Welcome to the Jungle or Paradise City. Fuck all that noise, man. Rocket Queen all the way. I thought you were more of a November Rain kind of guy. Well, I mean, if you're going to go the use your illusions. Right, right. I mean, uh, then I'm actually... God, what was that fucking song that had the, the dolphins crying in the video? The, the dolphin noises. Not November Rain. But it was like the third one in the Guns N' Roses music video trilogy. Comment down below. What video am I thinking of? What Guns N' Roses song am I thinking of? Leave it in the comments. It was the whole spaghetti incident now. <laughs> <laughs> in its entirety. Oh, we got a happy holla hooch from Mr. Viega. The spooky gooches are out tonight. But watch out for your kids' candy. Oh, I don't like that phrasing at all. Oh, fuck! Drew, I need you to do me a favor. We're so unprepared, we're so caught up in the Halloween goodness that I need to have my producer, Donkey, just do a quick thing. Can you plug that microphone in over there? You know this one that we're trying, <laughs> that we're trying to use right here, this very microphone? Check. <laughs> uh, Mike? Mike says, is it Don't Cry? The song you're thinking of? Ooh, maybe it's Don't Cry? I just threw a wire down there for you. I'm, I'm letting everyone peek behind the curtain right now into, into how these videos are made. Checking, the, checking. Showing how the sausage gets made. Is it ruining it for everyone? I'm gonna, I just gotta check to make sure the audio is working now properly. Happy Halloween, everyone in internet land. I hope everyone is having a safe, fun Halloween. Yeah, that's working. <laughs> okay. Okay. Audio works. Okay, good. If the audio just goes out randomly, it's hella. It's Doki's fault. We'll fire him. <laughs> If you have your Dark Side Records app up on your phone, we want to send a push, more pushing for the cushion. Again, I don't need to tell you. You're already watching the video. Here it goes. Boom. Here's one for the Android folks. Boom. Double push. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Uh. Hey, hey internet. internet. It is Thursday, motherfucking Halloween, October 31st. I'm William Axel Rose, and of course, joined as always by my friend, Mr. Sacco. I'll just tell you right now, if you can get this video to get a uh, hundred likes, I will let him Mr. Sacco me in the mouth. You've heard it. 100 likes. Make heard it, it here first. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Make it happen. Please. Uh, it is Thursday night, uh, and that, of course, brings us to a special thing that we're trying to bring back here. We should do these videos on Fridays, but we just never seem to be able to, to make them happen. So Thursday night seems to be doing okay. We seem to be, yeah. like, getting a flow. It's, it's getting back into it, and we just like to give you a little taste of some of the new releases that come out each Friday. A little sampling, a morsel, a crudité, a, uh, what do you call the little slices of meat that they put out in a thing that was in uh, the third episode of uh, the new Paul Rudd show on Netflix? Crudité? I don't know. Eh. Anyway, it's a little bit of the we like to call the new release roundup. Yeah! So that's right. So, of course, we have a whole bunch of, I'm just rushing through this really fast here. Uh, we have a whole bunch of new music that comes out every Friday here at Dark Side. You can find all your favorites on all your favorite formats. Vinyls, CDs, cassettes. Yes, I'm aware that vinyls is not the plural of vinyl. I just felt like saying it because it's Halloween and I'm drunk. Uh, so <laughs> we just want to share with you some of the stuff that will be out tomorrow morning, Friday, November 1st. We'll be open at 10 a.m. You can come and chop all these and more here at Dark Side Records. Uh, no dibs in this video. It's not like your used to's previews for use where you snooze, you lose. Do's. I couldn't think of the last thing to rhyme there. 
But uh, I guess you could call. If you call a dib on this video, we'll just put it on hold and you can come pick it up tomorrow morning, uh, Friday, here at Dark Side Records. Of course, if you want to get the jump on new releases, uh, just pre-order. Let us know if you know of something that's coming out so we can get it for you. Make sure you get it on street date. Or around street date. If it shows up on street date. Uh, you know. That's a whole other conversation. It, right, right. Uh, but of course, pre-order in-store. See one of our associates. Pre-order on our website, darksiderecords.com. And uh, make sure you get the new Gooch. That's right. And don't forget to uh, head on over to our website, uh, darksiderecords.com. And you were, while you're there, you can sign up for our email list. So you can get early access to all these. You can get early dibs on all the used new arrivals before they go out on the floor. There's a whole bunch of gooch special events like this. The big one that's coming up this fall, Black Friday. Better known as Record Store Day Black Friday. You know, the step sibling to Record Store Day. Mm -hmm. It happens right here, Black Friday, November 29th. Uh, we'll be open at 9 a.m. Similar to Record Store Day, there are exclusive releases. But not just that, there's a whole bunch of fun stuff we're gonna have planned. Officially, as of yesterday, we're welcoming back your Poughkeepsie boy, G Money, yes. with fried chicken and waffles all day long. It's, I'm told, delicious. I don't, I don't dig on chicken, but I'm told it's good. It's, it's, it's damn good. It's damn good. Uh, there'll be beers, there'll be giveaways, there'll be a store-wide sale, a whole bunch of stuff going down. Head on over to our Facebook, RSVP to the event, get all the info. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, a couple happy Halloweens, uh, happy Halloweeny for Mr. Jeff Koch, and a uh, happy Guccuween for Mr. Gorman. Oh, <laughs> well, I like that. <laughs> uh, Dave Baccio says happy Halloween. Okay, all right. That's right. Michael Viega just says, notification. <laughs> That's it. One word. Notification. <laughs> Pushed. Oh, okay. Pushed. Oh, uh, what the hell. So, shall we talk about some new stuff? Yeah, let's start off with some CD action. Uh, hello, Mr. Blue Sky. It's Jeff Lynn's ELO, his newest one from out of nowhere. Look. There it is. From I should, out of nowhere. I should have threw it to you. That's what I should have done there. Uh, available on CD and deluxe LP, which is on gold vinyl with a lenticular cover. JB didn't give it to me, so I wouldn't scratch it the whole time. You could just, I could just, I could just feel it now. <laughs> <laughs> also out this week, this is uh, the TP, the Tommy Boy pick of the week. New motherfucking Nile. Oh. Uh, it's called Vile Melodic Rites. And it's out this week on CD. I mean, I feel like I'm getting a sidebar really quick here. <laughs> They're playing the chance next Friday. They're oh! fucking playing the chance next Friday. So come here, pick up the new CD. There's going to be an LP version. Come pick them up here. Bring them to the show. Get them to sign it. Then bring it back here and show it off. And just, you know, yeah. flex that sweet uh, nerd points. <laughs> uh, next up is a fan club edition. Mm. Official edition. It's the bootleg series. Dylan doing it again volume 15 uh, so this one we got cuts from uh, the John Wesley Harding sessions we got Dylan and Cash cuts from their session and that's Johnny Cash and of course 3 CD LP available as well they just keep they just keep finding uh, how <laughs> where finding where them. are all of these and a nice expensive vault <laughs> Indeed. Yep. I just had to explain to someone I knew about how all along the Watchtower was about him crashing his motorcycle right here in the Hudson Valley going up to the Mohawk Mountain House. Oh, shit. Yeah. I just explained that to someone else, Absolutely. apparently, as we <laughs> speak. <laughs> Over 40 songs, perfect for any Dylan fan. Oops, sorry, donkey. This week, uh, there is a ton of reissues going out this week. It's a surprising amount of anniversaries uh, this week for a lot of uh, albums that you may know and love. Like this one I've got in my hand here, R.E.M.'s Monster. And this is a monster reissue from R.E.M. I've got in my hands here, it's the 25th anniversary edition. This one is the Deluxe CD. It is a five CD, one Blu-ray edition. It's got the album completely remixed by original producer Scotlett. 
It's got 15 previously unreleased demo, I assume from the same vault where they're keeping all those Bob Dylan ones. Uh, yep, yep. That's right. It's got a two-disc unreleased live set from the 1995 Monster Tour. It's got uh, a concert film called Road Movie. It's got uh, a high-res 5.1 series around audio mix. It's got all the official music videos, extensive liner notes, and it's an inch and a half thick. Hey! Wink. So, for you REM fans, this is a beefy one. There's also a deluxe LP edition, and I believe a standard CD and a standard LP edition. Indeed. But so, uh, REM fans, come get it. Speaking of anniversary reissues, speaking of thick boys, <laughs> we got The Doors Soft Parade 3 CD plus an LP coming at you hardcover book style. Uh, so here you got nearly two hours of unreleased session work. I want to go to this vault. Uh, right? I want to go there. <laughs> uh, you, got a, you got a movie, the hour-long uh, jam Rock is Dead. It's too long. That just <laughs> I would have went 30 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and a brand new master by Bernie Grundman. Not to be confused with Bernie Grundle. <laughs> Doors, soft parade. Uh-oh, Ryan Johnson asking Come on. Mr. Sacco's right here. Come on. Always got Mr. Sacco on hand. You think he wasn't going to be complete with the costume here? Ryan, as I said at the beginning of this video, because I assume you just got here, uh, if this video can get up to 100 likes, I will let him Mr. Sacco me. Tell your friends. So share, share. this vid. Get some <laughs> likes going. All right? We're officially at two. So you got five more minutes. Quote Bon Jovi, we're halfway there, right? Uh, Pretty close. All right. Um, I'm more of a glass half full kind of guy. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's talk about some new stuff that's out this week. I've got in my hands one here from Cold War Kids. For everyone who's been watching Chernobyl on HBO, it's depressing. Uh, this album is called New Age Norms 1. I don't know if there's a New Age Norms 2. Maybe someone can confirm that in the comments below. Let us know. But it is the new one from Cold War Kids. It is out this week on a CD and a vinyl. I think it's a colored vinyl. It doesn't say anything. But I saw, I read a little thingy online that said that this might be on an opaque, kind of whitey bluesy kind of thing. <laughs> so someone come buy this and let's open one up and find out together, all right? Cold War Kids, new one, out this week. Um, and I figured, since it's Halloween, no better time to show you the new Home Alone Christmas album. <laughs> out, <laughs> out on uh, Holly Green record this week. These are the Christmas cuts from Home Alone 1 and 2, the only ones that matter, although 3 had the Chumbawamba song. There I get three? Yeah, there's there was four of them. With Macaulay Culkin? No, no, no. They stopped that too. Uh. So that's why, you know. But uh, number three had that Chumbawamba song, I get knocked down and I get up again. And hey, man, gonna gonna hit me now. Now. Yeah, you know it, you know it. Uh Alan Jackson, John Williams, TLC. I'll stop there. Gorman, <laughs> Tom Petty. Home Alone Christmas, your perfect. Actually, the only Christmas music you need to listen to this holiday season. Mm -hmm. Happy mm -hmm. Halloween. Uh, something I forgot to mention real quick. Cold War Kids, new album that is out this week that we were just talking about. Uh, as we often get uh, when we get new releases, we get a whole bunch of... That was like a cobweb or something right there. We get a whole bunch of uh, goodies, gooch, fun stuff that come with it. And this week, if you come and get the Cold War Kids, you can get this Cold War Kids New Age Norms 1 print it's here it's on heavyweight paper it's screen printed we've got a handful of these first come first serve so anybody who comes and picks up the record you can get one of these hanging up in your bomb shelter do it for the gooch that's right <laughs> also out this week a new one from stray to the past stray from the path i forgot <laughs> how to speak uh if you're a fan of drop kicking people off of stages this is an album for you my friends the album is called Internal Atomics. Uh, it is from the good folks. Wow, I'm all thrown up here. Uh, Straight from the Path, new album out this week for you pop punkers. 
I assume. This is the BKP of the week, mm -hmm. I think. Mm -hmm. The Brian Kendrick pick of the week. There you go. Um, next one is uh, is the co co picks right here. It's it's my pick and it's Drew's pick of the week. Who? Drew. Donkey. Sorry. Oh. Donkey. It's the Michael Kiwanuka's new album, Kiwanuka. He likes. He <laughs> approves. Out this week on 2LP. If you need some uh, some R&B and soul this week, look no further. Um, produced by Mr. Mouse. Mr. Danger Mouse. Yeah. It's a good cut. It's a good cut. We already listened to it. It's my copy. Spun it. Great. Now listen. Listen to it. He ain't wrong. Uh, going back to talking about reissues that are out this week, there's a couple albums that are celebrating their 50th anniversary this week. This week. Oh. One was the <laughs> one was the Doors, and one is this one right here, the Rolling Stones. Let it bleed. Let it bleed. Let, Let it bleed. bleed. <laughs> Let it bleed. <laughs> or we could sing Wait and Bleed. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I pushed the cake into my <laughs> mouth. Um, <laughs> Rolling Stones, Let It Bleed, 50th anniversary, a huge celebration from the boys. Still performing it. <laughs> They'll take your money. Well done. It's on 180 gram LP. There's also a CD. I believe there's also a super deluxe version of this that's coming out. But uh, you know the stones, you know the cuts, and yes, of course, it has Monkey Man, and you can't always get what you want on it. So come and pick up a Stones reish back out this week. And one more anniversary action too. It's the King Crimson. Uh, Kevin. Escobar earlier commented and said, Ooh, that King Crimson. Ooh. Yeah, you know. That's right. In you the know. Court of the Crimson King, 50th anniversary, also out this week here. It's on, I believe, 200 grams. It's about 50 grams too many, mm -hmm. if you ask old JB, who knows nothing about record weights and what that means. <laughs> but uh, 200 gram LP out this week. Come and hear the song that they stole for Asuka's theme song in WWE. Oh. Ryan will get that. Um, all together now, it's the new turnover record. Another Brian Kendrick pick of the mm. week. Uh, I ask this question every time we get turnover. Oh, what's your favorite kind of turnover? Apple. Mm. That's why we do this. Right out the gate. That's why we do this. That's why. That's why I got that flow. Turnover, the new one on indie exclusive colored variant. What color is it? Black and yellow galaxy vinyl. Whoa, I was told it was on purple, so let me go update my email that I'm going to send out tomorrow morning real quick. And, like JB mentioned, there's always some cool stuff to give away. And this week, we got a little keychain. A little turnover all together keychain. So can, you can keep your keys all together. That's the best segue I've ever heard in my life right there. <laughs> also, Ryan said he loves the costumes. Thank you, Thanks, Ryan. Ryan. Uh, another one that's out this week, uh, if you got this Black Label Society Sonic Brew 20th Anniversary uh, reissue here, I got a perfect accompaniment and accoutrement. You can spin it, you can play it, you can wear it as a mask. Boom! A die-cut skull pick disc from Sonic Brew. It's the song Black Pearl from uh, Black Label Society, of course, featuring Zach Wilde. Uh, of course, you might also know him as being Ozzy's, one of Ozzy's iconic guitar players, uh, who this week said in a statement that he would still be down for doing a Pantera tribute tour with Philip Anselmo. Okay, okay. That one's going to start a fight on the internet. <laughs> oh, so <laughs> many fights on the internet. That there groan. <laughs> I don't know if that groan came out on the audio here, but that <laughs> pretty much sums up how most of the world feels. Rest in peace, Diamond Benny. True. Oh, so, are we done? That's it? That's all we got? That'll do. Hey, That'll right. do, donkey! <laughs> <laughs> so, as I mentioned at the top of this video, everything you see here in this video is available here at Dark Side Records with a whole bunch more. You can see the whole list uh, on our website, or if you sign up for our email list, you get the whole thing emailed to you nice and pretty in your email box. And uh, come here tomorrow morning, 
We'll be open at 10 a.m. here at Darkside Records, located at 611 Duchess Turnpike in Poughkeepsie. Uh, if you're not too hungover from going to Dogwood to see the Hissy Fits with the old pal JB tonight for Halloween, or from the candy binge that you're about to go on, because oh. I know you. I see you there. I know what you do. I don't judge. I just know. Anyway, so that's a whole bunch of new stuff. Come pick it up here at Dark Side. Uh, thank you for watching. As always, if you enjoy this video, uh, subscribe. Follow us on the YouTubes. Uh, leave a nice comment. What are we at? How many likes are we at for this video here? There's six. We're at six. We're at six. Almost to 100. So uh, thank you for watching. We'll be back again uh, here on Monday with our used twos for used previews for use twos. Previews. For yous. Don't snooze. Twos. Then you lose. Previews. Doos. If there was a pigeon, it'd say coos. Drinking brews. <laughs> Out of a coos, E.